Hey guys, Mike from CCTV Camera Pros here. In this video, I'm gonna show you two simple ways to search for AI object detection events using the Viewtron security camera system that we have installed here at CCTV Camera Pros office. So on this system, uh, the, the, the cameras that are in view right now, uh, this is an LPR camera right here in the lower left, and the other four, uh, sorry, the other three cameras our regular AI security cameras. And our front door camera is set up to detect uh, human objects in an intrusion zone. And uh, these two cameras are set up to detect vehicles that pass by in the back area of our warehouse. And then the uh, license plate recognition camera obviously is set up to detect license plates. Watch how I can easily use the mouse connected to the NVR to uh, query the system's database for recorded events from these AI security cameras. Here's the live security camera view on my Vutron NVR. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna access the main menu system uh, by clicking in the lower left here, and then I'm gonna select Intelligent Analytics. This is the screen that you can search for all the AI events. So on the left, I'm gonna select vehicle at first because the first uh, search I'm gonna do is for license plate recognition. I'm gonna select yesterday for the day, and then I'm gonna select the Vutron LPR camera. And then for the event type, I'm gonna select plate detection. Press OK, and then when I click the search button, it's gonna search the database for all the license plate recognition events that occurred yesterday. And if I click on any of these, it'll display that event. It'll show a uh, kind of a thumbnail of the video in the lower left. So next, I'm going to change the date to uh, today. And uh, this time, I'm going to search multiple cameras. I'm going to uncheck the LPR, and I'm going to select the two overview cameras that we use with the LPR uh, in the back. So I'm going to select the rear and the north overview camera, and then I'm going to select intrusion detection and uncheck plate detection. Press OK and then I press search again. So this time it's searching for uh, uh, vehicle object detection events from both of the overview cameras. And what I'll do is I will click on one of the events here. I'll click on this van. And again, it's, it's displayed in that thumbnail in the lower left. But if I want a full screen playback, I can check that checkbox and then click playback. And then the recorded video player comes up and I can use these controls here to pause the video, uh, go forward and reverse. Uh, I can speed it up and slow it down, so on and so forth. And when I'm done looking at the video, I can click this X in the lower right to close that screen. So last, I'm gonna to switch to human object detention, detection because I'm gonna query the front door camera that, that, uh, uh, that detects human objects in an intrusion zone. So I'm gonna to switch uh, to that camera and select intrusion and again, click search. And then here's all the human object detection events so far from today. And again, same thing, you can click on any of these events and it'll play back the video in the mini player in the lower left. And if I want to play back the recorded video surveillance full screen, again, I can check that and click playback and the video player opens. And again, I can use these controls down here at the bottom of the screen. So next, I'm going to close the intelligent analytics screen and show you another way you could search for AI events. If I double click on any of these cameras, it'll bring up that camera's live view full screen. And then if I click on the menu button down here and select playback, notice this timeline scrubber over here on the right. There's a dark blue which shows it's recording 24 by seven around the clock, but these, these, these lighter blue areas show all of the AI object detection events. So all the, all the times that cars and trucks were detected by this camera. So you can easily jump to any of the AI events using this timeline when the uh, camera is in playback mode, as you see here. And you can, ex you can expand that timeline by using the magnifying glass here in the lower right. And again, I'm just gonna click on another event here and you can see another car was detected. And when I'm done, again, I can click the X in the lower uh, right and I'll be brought back to the live view of that security camera and I can switch back to the four camera live view by clicking on that grid icon and on the bottom bar. Guys, I hope this video has been helpful. As you see, it's really simple on these Vutron NVRs to go back and search for recorded events that were uh, detected by these Vutron AI security cameras. If you have any questions about any of this, feel free to reach out to me anytime. 
I can be reached directly via email at mike at cctvcamerapros.net. If you want to learn more about these Vutron AI security camera systems, please visit www.cctvcamerapros.com slash AI. Thank you for watching.